Okay, I am almost to that required thing. Um, when you, if you look at any reviews about this plane, and actually about any rabbit plane, you find that it's very difficult, or people have difficulties getting it to cut square. And the problem, I think, is that you, your main force is pressing against the side, right here, against the side of the board. And there's been some reviews that don't really care for this knob that Veritas put on here. And I find I don't use it. I find it's easier if I press right here where you see my hands. Look at that shading coming out of there. I mean, that's just like awesomeness. This is a very wide rabbit because this frame is going to be usable for either a stretch canvas or a panel. So it's like an inch and an eighth deep. But as I check it, it is like perfectly square, which is what I wanted. Absolutely perfectly square. My concern is always the depth. As you know, I had a little bit of problems with the depth gauge on the, the uh, small plow plane, which I might put a video on afterwards. Because the plan for this particular frame is to be beaded, on one portion, you can tell I'm almost, almost there. Cuts are getting thinner. Okay, we are there. One final cleanup cut if necessary. And that's it. Okay, hope you enjoyed that. That's just a little demonstration of what the skew rabbit plane can do. The results are a whole lot of really, really nice looking shavings. Thanks for watching.